So, small update on, well actually a big update on the soundproof box thingy. I finally finished putting the soundproof foam on all the walls. I did the cutouts, that was going to be the air intake. And this is going to be where the hot air e exits the thing. I already have a machine in here with the tubings in place, it's quite sturdy. And it's, they're obviously going to go exit there. Now I still have to put this two bad boys into here and all the power supplies for the thingies. I did this cutout for the switch so that all the ethernet cables are gonna go over there but I kind of forgot to do the one for the power so I'll have to cut a thingy in there. But aside from that, that's all and see you in the next one. So uh, here's the final video on this thing. Oh hey, that's me, hello. <laughs> I, um, it's already up and running and you can feel it's hot to the touch, <laughs> like this thing gave out a lot of heat. I've got two dedicated tubes for the uh, A1 and two which go to a single one using an adapter that I 3D printed for the two C1 machines. It pulls in fresh air from there, actually, god damn it, you can see, give me a second. Pulls in uh, cold air from here, like you can really feel it sucking in, go work. And then just outside really, so that it won't, my office won't get hot. And trust me, it really does help out with the noise too. I'll also show you inside actually. You might not be able to hear me, but oh well. And that was it really. It's still not finished though, like I still gotta put some dedicated legs, paint it and some supports to hold this in place because right now it's just wobbling over here. But for now it's at least running, I can have my machines on and making some money I guess rather than just standing there doing nothing. But oh well, there is my server, computer and my office which honestly is a big mess right now but I just haven't had time to clean it up. But anyways, this was all. I'm not sure if I'll probably make another video like painting it or so, probably not. Do let me know if you want to make me a more detailed one on how I made all of that, in case you want to make one yourself too. But anyways, that was all and thank you for watching.